after sewing that, it looks like this. So now I'm about to go to the sewing machine and take off some on the side seam. So this is one side seam and this is the other side seam. And then I'm also going to be taking out some in the middle. working on the top. Here's the back of the top. Remember, I already took away the part of the collar, but I'm going to take away fabric here so that way it fits. So this is the back piece, and that's about how much I'm going to get rid of on the seam. For the collar, I'm going to keep the bottom collar, but I'm going to move it because I'm getting rid of some of this part. So I'm gonna cut it here and have it go there, and that's where it's gonna sew to me see what I'm saying but I'm gonna cut it after I sew this back piece together but right now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna seam rip this apart because this part I don't need for right now I went ahead and I pinned the hemline so I added elastic I sewed the elastic on the inside at the end and then I sewed it as well to this side then I folded this over twice so that way it will be clean on the inside and then I pinned it like so so now I'm just gonna go ahead and sew this down So I have a pin here. I also have a pin here. So I'm going to put a snap button there and right there. I'm going to do the same thing to the top. a score so there's one leg there's the other leg I have a snap button here I also have a snap button here I use the original button and buttonhole on one of them I re-added this fake pocket here and then I left this one I didn't have to take this one off this one is the original attachment to the top I added elastic on the hem because it was a little big this was a size large blazer this is the original bottom half of the collar I took off majority of the neckline so that way I can get this back and then I went ahead and I added a snap button here a snap button here and then a snap button here I left the sleeves alone I love that it's like a little mini so cute this is the end result I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial till next time